All right, Colwyn Farm. Now, today we are playing a end game Wraith build. So, we of course are going to be running Noed, Remember Me, Blood Warden, and No Way Out. Uh, so this should be a lot of fun. I'm pretty excited overall. We're running Windstorm and Shadow Dance with our real objective to get a few hooks and then to snowball it out in late game, bringing Shadow Dance to remove pallets a little bit quicker and maybe make some outplays here and there. But for a majority of it, we're really just trying to remove as many resources as possible. But I am going to go for the win as soon as possible as well. So I'm not going to hold back for any reason. So you went back here. Hello. Drop it. Get back in stealth here so I can get some damage done. Hey dude, what's going on? Getting everyone injured would be really nice too. And he's my obsession, so we're already getting stacks of Remember Me, which is great. We can fake this. Perfect. Anything else we get just a little bit quicker here. Nice. Remember me value coming in. And we're going to go around because we saw the guy on the gen. Hey, buddy. Just for some extra pressure. Someone came around. Maybe to go for the pickup. Oh, they got him. Crazy. Oh, that health kit. Okay. Makes sense. Ring the bell. That way he knows I'm coming for him. There we go. The other guy healed up already. They brought some good health kits. Those are some fast heals. But I need more stacks to remember me. So, uh, come here, my dude. Thank you. I'm almost got all my stacks already. This is great. No slowdown, so we just need to get a few stacks of No Way Out. And then try and close it out towards the end. I can't believe we're actually already on day 29 of Wraith. Isn't that insane? Like, look at how far we've actually came all together. Nuts. So make sure, of course, you're hitting that like and subscribe button. That way you can catch the next three days. And, of course, you can maybe pick who's going to be the next 30-day killer. Because we only got one more day. Who do I want to go for here? I'm going to do this and go for their guy. Oh, he was watching. So he's going to lead me away. Going up here is not a bad thing. I can kind of play around this pretty well now. Yeah, that's always a win, it feels like. The Fang is probably on a gen somewhere. I do want to try and slow the game down just a little bit. Nothing too much, but I have to buy myself some time so I can get some stacks of No Way Out. Nope. Sorry, buddy. Got dead hard? Nope. Good. I get my second stack of No Way Out right now. The other David is healed up. Totally fine. Two stacks. Hey, it's your turn. I need to hit you. Oh! <laughs> Slid off just a little bit there. Ah, Deliverance. So he probably has Deliverance and uh, Decisive, if I had to guess. Oh, hello, both of you. Four stacks. Come here, buddy. I really need you to go down for me. If I could remove at least one player from the game, that'd be great. You okay? You good? Works for me. If I remove him from the game later on, then I don't have to worry about three people at endgame. Which, it's coming. Survivor was over here working on this gen. Or at least was.
Yeah, someone was here. I think that's when we first started. So we'll just kick that, get that regressing. This poor soul. <laughs> so unlucky. Oh, I thought I was in it. Damn it. That's a little bit of a misplay there. Just a bit. Nice dead hard. You timed that well. I know I thought that pal was still up. But we'll just call that some asserting dominance. I can't hear you there, bud. Crazy. I lost him just in the corn. I get corn blindness. Something fierce. There you go. Wait, haven't I already downed you and hooked you? I'm pretty sure I have. Actually, I'm really positive. Four hooks, but they're separated on two people, so I didn't get a lot of value out of No Way Out if they popped that last gen. Remember Me might really come in play, though. And if we can get Blood Warden to work off, that'd be great. Let's check over here on this gen real quick. I haven't seen Fang all game. But I got kind of a three gen going on, so... Hey, buddy. I really need you to go down for me. Just really quickly. Trust me, it's worth it. It's going to be great. Great content. Oh, okay, I got you. I got you. There we go. I'll break it. Get rid of as many of these pallets as I can for now. Dead hard? That was good, dead hard. Nice try, dude. So it's three stacks, no way out. Feels good. Oh. Hi. Smart play. And there is no Ed. Hell yeah. Which is the closest door? Over here for sure. Right? Hey, buddy. There goes another. Let's pick her up. Let's get her hooked out. I'm going to leave the other guy on the ground. I don't want him to know right away that I have Blood Warden. So this is why I'm hooking here. Because we have the other survivor who's also already on the ground. Now, he might get brave and come over here, but we'll see. There we go. Nice. We might not even have to worry about Blood Warden. What's up, dude? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can kind of chase this all day. I don't know if I really want to, though. Yeah, let's not. Let's just hook this guy over here. Because he'll go for the save if I pick this guy up, right? It just makes sense. There we go. He went that way. The other dude went this way. We'll get rid of this pallet right away. Nice. Does he go for the save on the other person? Or does he try and get out? Definitely doesn't seem to be trying to get out. He's not going to find the totem. He was over here. Ooh. It's looking dirty so far. I... Oh, here he is. And there we go. Hell yeah. You know, we didn't get used uh, No Way Out but Blood Warden, but man. Whew. No Way came in pretty clutch here. This is the snowball we were looking for, so it really went perfectly to plan. I mean, I didn't really expect to get No Way Out to be crazy, but maybe he did go over there and it was blocked off, so... You know, it's very possible they saw, like, oh shit, it's, it's blocked off. So even if they wanted to go to it, they couldn't. And then Remember Me just makes them take even longer on that. So this was a super successful gameplay, hell yeah. 
and you love to see it. Everything coming to plan. And there you guys go. Merciless for a end game Wraith build. It was a lot of fun. We'll make sure to hit him with the GG's real quick. And, you know, this is the 29th day, guys. It's crazy. We only have one more day. Enjoy the rest of your games needing no ed. Oh, man. A little bit of salt. <laughs> oh, no, TTB. Don't do it. This, this is great for me. Just a little bit. No rank one needs no ed. You're right. I've shown 29 days. My bad. Let me rephrase that. 28 days where I didn't need it, and I still won those games. But hey, you know what? Some people just can't handle it. They get a little salty on it. That's just how it's going to be. That's all right. I, I always love uh, loving seeing salt. Whenever you bring Noed, you're, you're bound to get some salt. I just I see it all the time. It doesn't matter that we went with a full end game build and brought Noed. No, nah, no, nah, we had Noed. Therefore, we are bad. <laughs> it makes me laugh every time. I hope everyone has a great night. Much love. And as always, I'm Red. They're salty, and I'm signing off.